How to handle rejection in Tangle and, and Life. In this video, we're going to cover rejection and how to handle it. You can't please everyone. In the song Garden Party, the singer Ricky Nelson sings, I went to a garden party to reminisce with my old friends. And that was his fan base and a show he was giving at Madison Square Garden. It really wasn't a garden party. It was at Madison Square Garden. A chance to share old memories and play our songs again. When I got to the garden party, they all knew my name. Now, Ricky Nelson had grown up on TV playing uh, a member of the Audie and Harriet family TV show. He went on to become a teenage rock star. And on this day that he gave this performance in Madison Square Garden, he was an adult man. So no one recognized me. I didn't look the same. So when he started to sing new songs rather than the old songs from when he was a, a young teenage rock star, they started booing him. And he sings, but it's all right now. I learned my lesson well. You see, you can't please everyone, so you got to please yourself. What does this have to do with tango? Tango, through to its intimate embrace, requires a higher standard of desires met by both men and women to dance tango. At a milonga, ladies don't expect all the men to make offers to dance, and the men should not expect that their offers to dance will all be accepted either. There are a million and one subconscious reasons that cause desire or lack of it towards someone. Don't take offense. Rejection in Tango and Life. Life is a series of problems that we resolve to go on to the next one. First, you need to know how to tango. Then you have to, rather, you have to learn how to tango. Then you have to find the community you fit in with. Then you have to work on improving your skills. Next, start move going to tango communities you have never been to and meet new people. In life, we all suffer rejection in one form or another, and yet we survive. Gratefully accept the rejections and don't hold bad feelings towards the rejector. Accept it and move on with your life and your dancing. Dance as though no one is watching. Love as though you've never been hurt. Sing as though no one can hear you. Live as though heaven is on earth. A great little saying. And what this means is when you're out there dancing tango, you're not there to give a show. You're there to be in an intimate embrace, dancing with your partner, in synchronized dancing with others, in a community of people enjoying the moment. Yeah, if you're going to reject and be rejected. It takes two to tangle, and both must meet the invisible needs of subconscious desire. Don't be afraid of being rejected, or you will become a wallflower. Women should smile and be open to invitations. It could be your dress is the wrong color, or you're too short, fat, skinny, young, old, or any other number of things going in the head of the other people that are available to tangle. In the end, it has nothing to do with you. Remember, you can't please everybody. You could only please yourself. And that means if you're not being out asked to dance, don't beat yourself up. Don't, don't do a uh, pity party on yourself. Be happy that you're there. You're not home by yourself watching TV. You're out in the malonga with other people. Enjoy yourself. Because the right person and the right time will come your way. And remember, it only hurts if you let it. You have no control whatsoever on what is going on in the head of the person you are interested in dancing with. Who knows what is in another person's head? You may remind them of their ex or someone who they hate. They may mistake you for someone else. They might not like the color you're wearing. They may feel that you don't know the dance as well as they do and don't want to waste their time dancing with someone they feel is not at their level of expertise or the reverse and think they're not at your level. Rejection only hurts if you let it. We are all human. 
We all are not perfect. We are alive. We try things. We make mistakes. We stumble. We fall. We get hurt. We rise again and we try again and keep learning. We keep growing. And we are thankful for this priceless opportunity called life because it doesn't go on forever. Sorry to tell you. A right to their feelings. Because someone comes to a milonga does not mean that they are obligated to dance with anyone. That stands for women and men. If a person rejects your offer or you are the one be doing the rejecting, understand that it is a privilege to enter the intimate embrace, not a right. You have a right to your feelings and they to theirs. If you dance with someone and you are not compatible in tango skills or vibes, don't be offended they turn down your next request to dance again, or for the ladies if they don't ask you out again. Like Ricky said, you got to please yourself. Remember, most people just want to dance and are not looking for the love of their lives. We can't control the filters that others choose when they look at us. Great saying. Increasing your odds. If your local tango community does not have enough men or women, you should make an effort to bring more people into the tango community. Visit other tango communities in your area and help get the word out about your group. Follow all the tango etiquette rules. Beware of your personal hygiene. Invite teachers to give a lesson before your next milonga and they may attract dancers that may have not come to your milongas in the past. Visit our website, TangoOnTheHudson.com to post your next event and get the word out. Tango community. There's a feeling of community and inclusion in the Hudson Valley Tango population. There's always room for new members to come on the Tango dance floor. Tango dances are taking place all over the Hudson Valley, the world, and the tri-state area. So what are you waiting for? We recommend Danjo Dance Studio a wonderful young couple from Argentina who specializes in tango. And recently they had a wonderful milonga at their dance studio, which just was great. We also recommend TangoUnderTheTent.com, which is a non-for-profit tango organization here in the Hudson Valley. Go to our YouTube video uh, channel, we offer over 700 videos on all things tango. We have our own videos that we put together, tango everything you need to know, the top five mistakes in tango milongas, uh, the secret pleasure of Argentine tango. And if you go to our website, tangoonthehudson.com, you'll get articles, all the tango events that are going on in the area, videos, music, and lessons. So come on over. Let us hear from you, join the community, bring your friends, take some tango lessons because it's a, it's a dance that you have to take lessons. You can't just uh, ab hoc it. So if you see me at a milonga, come on over and say, hey, Bill, how you doing? And I look to hear from you and I hope that you subscribe, like this video, and share it with your friends. See you on the next video. Bye-bye.